Hello YouTube, welcome back. It's Connor again. It's been a little while. Um, the last tip I put up was for St. Max Basilica in the 2000 Guineas. Unfortunately, that horse ended up going to the French edition of the race and winning that uh, very impressively. So it's disappointing for the channel and myself for O'Brien just to pick the French race. But it happened, it's racing. I'm back today with another selection for Royal Ascot. Uh, 10 to win selection in the Commonwealth Cup. Uh, and it's going to be Archie Train, Archie Watson Train Dragon Symbol. Um, this horse is a speedball. Um, been super impressive on the all weather for the last couple of weeks, months. Uh, but it was the last race I'm particularly interested in. Stepped up to Grade Two Company, first race on turf, and didn't run, didn't run an optimum race. Uh, ran keen for the first furlong or two, and ran the. Last four furlongs with no cover, um, ran a solo down the near side. I thought that Haydock race was pretty strong, looked good on paper. Um, I like that um, call thumb, the third horse, the filly. Method, uh, who's a good two-year-old. And obviously the winner, Rohan, who's been a revelation on the on the all weather this year. Um, so yeah, Dragon Zimbo, I don't think he would have appreciated the ground being that heavy. I think he wants quicker ground. But for him to run a solo down the near side, literally on his own, no cover, and to get that close in a group two, shows the horse's ability. Um, relatively inexperienced. He could come forward again from this run. I think that is definitely definitely a possibility. Um, Rohan, last time out, the winner of this Haydock race, but last time out he won a Commonwealth Cup trial, trial at Ascot, uh, beating... Apollo One and Saint Lawrence, who did look smart, um, they both uh reopposed in the Haydock race. But ran downfield, possibly down to the ground. Maybe they wanted a bit it a bit quicker, but the third from that Ascot race, Spy Catcher went on to Frank the Form, um, finishing a second behind Creative Force, at Newbury, and an ever further two lengths back was Tactical. I think is a fair um, yardstick. You know, he's a decent horse. And for spy catcher to finish two lengths ahead, I think that gives the Rohan Ascot form a boost and therefore the Haydock form a boost as well. So yeah, I think 10 to 1 is more than a fair price for Dragon Symbol. I think if he races with a bit of cover at Ascot and um is sent on for the win late, I think he's I think he's got more than a good chance of winning and a definite chance of placing. Um that's gonna be the selection. Hopefully I have another one or two Ascot selections up for you all in the next couple of weeks uh, before it gets underway. And I have a anti-post selection for next year's Cheltenham Festival in a few days. Thanks for watching. Um, if you could drop me a like, subscribe, I'd really appreciate it. Take care. Cheers.